Hey, hey, it's week 20. Here we are on a brisk 40 degree day. And windy. And yeah, really windy. We're going to run five miles. We're running to our uh, favorite park. Uh, hey, thanks for joining us. Stick around because we'll have a recap. Week 20. Man, the wind's brutal. It really makes it cold. <laughs> so we've uh, reached the halfway point. Now we just have to go back to the car. We're warm enough, but it's not warm enough. <laughs> and that wind is brutal though. Oh man, I don't know if you can even hear us. Here's one thing I was thinking though, it's kind of it's kind of cool. We're fortunate that we get all kinds of weather to train in prior to the marathon because you never know what it's gonna be like. Florida weather is like Texas weather. Yeah, it's like, who knows? All right, another two and a half. Stick around, thanks. Five miles. <laughs> Felt okay. Yeah. Yeah. Up next, recap. Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> hey, hey, thanks for sticking around and thanks for watching. Oh my gosh, week 20 done. That means we only have eight weeks. It's less than two months away. So. Marathon so. is upon us. <laughs> yeah. So, you know, I hope your training's going well. Uh, we had a, a nice uh, five miler today, just an update. Mm -hmm. uh, week 21, it'll be a uh, 10K. We're running a race in California. Mm -hmm. Pretty excited about it. Now, it's uh, again flexible training, right? Uh, because we're going on vacation. We're going to be uh, at uh, Disneyland, uh, but we're going to run a, uh, a 10K out there. So bear with us. We're taking some new hardware with us. We hope <laughs> to have a video yeah, uploaded next hopefully week. Hopefully we can see. pull that off. So far on all of our vacations, we have not been able to publish something yeah. on the road. But maybe this time it's different. Yeah, maybe this time. <laughs> you know, we're really hoping the hotel has some form of internet. They do. That as is, they have in the past. And we still couldn't yeah, get it that's, up there. That's so. faster than a 2400 baud modem. <laughs> Uh, yeah. But we ran a day, and oh man, talk about a massive cold front. Cold front came in. It went from 70 degrees yesterday morning when we woke up. Mm -hmm. uh, a bunch of rain blew in. We got like an inch of rain, mm -hmm. and it dropped to 40 degrees by the time we went to bed. Yep. And then it was like 38 when we got up mm -hmm. and watched Millie this morning. Mm -hmm. And so um, I have a tendency, year after year, to forget how to dress for cold fronts. <laughs> Because we live in Texas, and it's yeah. normally just hot. hot. And humid. But then we have a couple months out of the year where it's cooler, <laughs> and we do have to run in different gear. Yeah. So this was our first cold run, which means this was my annual first run that I way overdressed for a, my first cold run. Happens every time. So... Um, the, the tricky part, though, was that it was super windy and yeah. the wind was so cold. Yeah. And on our walk with Millie, I had three layers on my arms mm -hmm. and I was still cold. So I was like, okay, all right, here's what I'm, here's what I'm going to do. So I put on my long pants 
that normally comes out in like lower 40 degree weather mm -hmm. uh, or, or below. Uh, so my long uh, tights, I put on a windbreaker mm -hmm. in addition to a long sleeve shirt. Yep. And I did my little headband because we did haircuts yesterday. So I have like a bald head, <laughs> like no hair whatsoever <laughs> on the coldest day we've had so far this year. Yeah. So my little, my little headband to cover my mm -hmm. buzzed head and ears uh, and gloves. Did I say windbreaker? Yes, windbreaker. Too much. It was too much, but I made it halfway before I started. I made it almost halfway before I started peeling clothes off. The gloves came off at probably mile two. Yeah. I would have been pretty uncomfortable if I hadn't had all the clothes on the first first. Oh time. yeah. So mile two, gloves came off. The gloves came off. <laughs> <laughs> Like at our turnaround point, I dropped the uh, the uh, windbreaker, windbreaker. Yeah. and then like half a mile ago, I lost the headband. Yeah. Not bad. Yeah. Well, it did warm up. It did. It did warm up a bit because the sun was yeah, out. Yeah, we right? didn't have. It wasn't overcast uh, or anything. But the wind. You the know, wind the wind was strong the whole yeah, time. Yeah, it really was. Uh, so it was chilly. you know, and I said at some point during the run, we're kind of fortunate to be able to train uh, with uh, you know all all sorts of uh, weather conditions because you never know what's going to happen in Florida in 2017. Pretty sure it was 2017, uh, they canceled a half marathon at uh, Disney World because of, I don't know, I bad weather. I think it was freezing. Yeah. I, I think it was frozen outside. So, and we know in 2020, they cut the marathon route short because it was too hot. so hot. Yeah. So. And one time at one of the, the Star Wars races that we participated in, they postponed the 5K, I think, mm -hmm. because we weren't of, running uh, it, but yeah, thunderstorms. We heard that it was uh, yeah. it was postponed. Yeah. yeah. So you know, you never know. Yeah. So you know, we're we're fortunate. We get to train in <laughs> we all have kinds of stuff. Run in all sorts of weather here. Apparently, it doesn't matter what we run in; we run the same pace. So this know, is true. Uh, which is uh, also known as slow. Well, uh, we do run slower in the hot. Oh yeah, that's true. Yeah, we are, we are slightly hot. slower when it's it gets hot. hot. But less <laughs> less than two months away, you know, and you know uh, this awesome mm. mug. I don't know if you can uh, see that mug. One of our favorites, if not our very favorite, that we purchased at uh, one of the expos. Uh, definitely our favorite because it's the only one that's ever been dishwasher safe. What? Why? Wow. Why are you making hand wash only mugs? I know. We should. Uh, and, and it was. We'll, we'll remember on another one to show the oh, one yeah. from the next Star yeah. Wars You'll race that, that we put in the dishwasher <laughs> and like lightsabers moved and like repasted <laughs> elsewhere. Luke, it's Luke ridiculous. Skywalker's head came off, twisted. It and did. Went it went like upside down. It's the weirdest looking hand. <laughs> Why? These are awesome. Why? But, you know, I bring that up because, <laughs> you know, navigating the expo anymore, it's so different. You know, uh, mm. you know, uh, too many people uh, and, you know, the logistics of all that. I think the last time we were there for the last marathon, by the time we got in, everything was gone. Mm -hmm. uh, and now uh, apparently they tried a, a virtual uh, queue. Uh, for the wine and dine for the expo yeah. uh, and then we never get there uh, early enough because you know we don't we don't do dopey so we don't have to be there yeah uh, we roll in on friday yeah so by the time <laughs> we get there everything's gone we're hopeful hopeful we can find a, a good set of mugs uh in less than two safe. months yeah dishwasher <laughs> dishwasher these are these Gotta are be awesome. able to throw in the if, if if any of you have these let us know we we love these these it was are a awesome. great race yeah it was your first half marathon yeah it was it was they need to bring the, the star wars runs back right they're, they're gonna do that right and we're gonna run through bat two right they got it i don't think it's happening <sighs> yeah so um that's kind of it for us yeah we're packing and we're gonna hit the road. Yeah. Or hit the air and then we'll hit the road, flying there, driving back. Yeah. <clears throat> yeah, it's gonna, gonna be a kind of adventure. It's gonna be yeah, it's gonna be really interesting. You know, flying out there, you know, several hour flight, uh, coming back. We're talking several days. Several. Days. That's a long way, man. If you've ever driven from California east, uh, you know, you think you're doing all right. You get through California quickly. Arizona's not too bad. New Mexico. Mm -hmm. yeah. You hit Texas and it's like you started all over again. So uh, <laughs> it's going to be it's going to be a lot of fun. We're going to have a lot of fun again. Yeah. We are hopeful to have a video up next week. 
uh, it'll be that uh, 10K we've never participated in. Yeah. And that's going to be pretty exciting. We're going to have a lot of footage of that. It'll be fun. Uh, wonderful friends are going to join us. Yeah. Thank you, by the way, for your suggestions of places to visit, yes. things to do. We really appreciate that. And we're hopeful that we'll have the time to do that because, uh, you know, our, our, our time, you know, to, 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 to get into the race, to get out of the race, to hit the road, to start heading for, mm -hmm. uh, you know, Arizona. Uh, but thank you very much. Mm -hmm. Let us know how your training's doing. Let us know what's going <laughs> on. So far, we are feeling better about running yeah. uh i think most of the uh, negative effects of covid are uh, dissipating to the point where you know <gasps> most. yeah most not all no, we're still <laughs> not all. yeah you know oh man yeah still yeah, yeah. it's okay yeah, it's, so, it's gonna be okay everything's gonna be okay yeah yeah it, it'll be all right it'll, it'll be all right week 20. that's okay. unbelievable that's I mean, our we looked at our sticker chart. By the way, uh, he, here's a here's a brief here's look. Here's how at, we're doing. Here's how we're doing. Here's how we're doing. We looked at our sticker chart. We're mm -hmm. like, holy man, when did all this get filled up? I, know. I mean, I can't even uh, I can't even take a picture anymore without like cutting off the first part of our. Mm -hmm. Man, time is flying. Um, wow. Yeah, we're leaving in a few days. Yeah. And get this. We have made zero progress on our costumes. So when we when we get back, when we get back, it's going to be... Oh, it'll be fine. It's always last minute. It'll be fine. It's always last minute. You know why? Because it's always an adventure with you. We'll see you in a week. Thanks.